Hey, Psych2Goers, welcome back to another video. Have you ever wondered if you're surrounded by the right people? Perhaps there are people in your inner circle of friends who are only around when they need something. Maybe you find that they always seem to agree with everything you say and do, or maybe they always like the same thing as you. It's difficult to know whether someone is a truly nice person or not, especially if they always disguise themselves as such around you. Because of their seemingly nice behavior, a lot of fake people get away with being labeled as good, despite their toxic habits. So to help you figure out whether the people in your life are really good for you, here are six common traits of fake nice people. Number one, they only respect people with power. Have you ever noticed someone acting extra nice when meeting people with a relatively high social status? It's normal to behave differently when interacting with people of a higher status. For example, you wouldn't treat the Queen of England the same way as you treat your friends. However, if you notice that change in behavior is too drastic, chances are that person is a fake nice person. As a general rule, you should always judge a person by how they treat their subordinates, not their seniors. By applying this general rule, you may just be able to determine whether someone is a truly nice person or just someone who is interested in other people's power and status. Number two, they pretend to try to please everyone. Do you know someone who puts an incredible amount of effort into pleasing everyone? Because they want everyone to like them. They can't stand the idea of being rejected. This need to please everyone will make them say yes to anything and everything that is asked of them, which often leads to them being labeled as nice and friendly. But oftentimes, you'll find that they can't actually come through with their promises. Whether it's because they've made too many promises to too many people, or because they don't feel motivated to fulfill what they had said. People like this tend to disappoint in the end. Number three, they desperately seek attention. Are you friends with someone who always needs attention before doing something nice? Fake nice people are always desperate for attention, so they'll tend to do things to receive praise. In contrast, genuinely nice people aren't motivated by external factors, such as other people's approval or attention. Instead, they're motivated by internal values, so they'll do good things and help others because they want to. If you notice that your friends stop doing nice things when you don't praise them for it, then it might be a sign that their behavior is not genuine. Number four, they gossip and talk behind your back. Do you have a friend who's always gossiping and talking behind people's backs? While everyone has the right to express their opinions and say what they think, gossiping and talking about someone behind their back is a harmful way of attacking and damaging someone's reputation and character. Instead, people who are genuine tend to express their emotions openly and are willing to talk through their disagreement with the person they're opposed to. Number five, they disappear when you need them the most. Can you think of a friend who is never around when you need them the most? This is a very common trait among people who are fake. They tend to be there for you only when they need something from you, but never the other way around whether it's asking you for a favor or wanting to take part in your success. Fake nice people will only treat you well when it's convenient and beneficial for them. So you might want to avoid people like this if you don't want to end up in a one-sided relationship where you are constantly taken for granted. And number six, they avoid questions about themselves. Have you ever talked to someone who constantly avoided answering questions about themselves? Fake people tend to put an extraordinary amount of effort into avoiding any type of personal questions. The reason for this has to do with their general goal of wanting to be liked by everyone around them. By not answering any personal questions, they effectively avoid the risk of giving you the wrong impression or opinion of them. So instead, they may try to redirect the question towards you and then agree with whatever you say. Do any of these traits describe someone you know? Let us know in the comments below. Ultimately, it's always important to go with your gut. All the points we've mentioned gives you a general idea of what fake nice people might do in different situations. But in the end, it all depends on how you feel about them. If you found this video helpful, be sure to like, subscribe, and share this video with those who might benefit from it. And don't forget to hit the notification bell icon to get notified whenever Psych2Go posts a new video. As always, the references and studies used in this video are added in the description below. Thanks for watching and see you in our next video.